Can you make a seat to keep yourself cool in the hot summer out of a foam pad and some dollar store cool packs? This week on Kayak Hacks. But I want to make it a little bit smaller than the width here and that way they'll fit into the two holes I'm going to cut tightly. Cut this chunk out. It's a really hot day here on the Cape Fear River in Wilmington. Pushing 105 and I need to stay cool when I'm fishing. So here's how we set this thing up. The first thing I did was I put a piece of cardboard underneath here since my seat it's not fully insulated like many kayak seats. Then I took these two dollar store cold packs out of a dollar store cold bag because you don't want to use these until you absolutely have to and I stuck them into the two holes that I cut. Now that's going to be too cold on your butt so you need to insulate yourself a little bit and that's what this white shop towel is for. Now you can sit on there and be comfortable. This is nice. I can feel the coolness getting up into my blood veins that go through my crotch and I can start to feel how I'm going to get cool elsewhere in my body. Now initially these ice packs are going to be rock hard because that's how they came out of the refrigerator but over time they're going to soften up a little bit and stay cool and it'll be more comfortable to sit on. It's the end of the day my kayak is 102.4 degrees and let's see what the deal is with my dollar store ice packs. The surface temperature is a chilly 58 degrees and I can still feel a thin hockey puck size of, uh, cold, of ice inside here. You can kind of see the outline of it as I squeeze this ice pack. They do get wet on the top so that's going to bleed through the towel and your butt is going to get a little bit wet but it's going to be cool and now that these have melted a little bit I've got a very comfortable seat here. So if I were going to do this all day I would have a couple of extra of these and just replace them as they get warmed up. I think this is a good idea. Thumbs up. Comments. Take care.